Atrial fibrillation is the most common heart rhythm condition in the world. It's an irregular heartbeat that can lead to symptoms along with consequences of stroke and heart failure. Patients have a variety of symptoms. And so there's no rule book on what a patient can or cannot feel. Oftentimes, you'll read patients have palpitations or feel their heart beat irregularly. However, majority of patients come with symptoms of fatigue. And oftentimes, my patients just tell me they just don't feel right. Over the years, we've identified several risk factors for atrial fibrillation. Most commonly, we found them to be hypertension, obesity, and sleep apnea. Those are what we consider to be the three major risk factors for atrial fibrillation. Patients are diagnosed through various ways. Uh, many times, they're first diagnosed by their primary care physician, and they're in for a routine office visit, and they hear an irregular heartbeat, or they report symptoms of an elevated heart rate or heart fluttering. With the advent of a lot of wearable devices, we are also finding patients pick atrial fibrillation up with a smartwatch or a mobile monitoring device. As technology is expanding and resources are expanding, we're finding more and more ways of protecting patients by detecting atrial fibrillation much earlier. We are here with a primary goal of the health of our patients. And we work with our patients, we talk to our patients, we communicate with our patients and their family members so that we are all together part of one team. And our team offers valuable, experienced, compassionate care with the end result of our patients living healthier, a higher quality of life, and for a longer period of time.